Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. That's right, I'm the only favorite Las Vegas realtor here in Vegas. <laughs> Just kidding. I am over here today at Cordillera, which is by Toll Brothers in the Red Point Square Village. The model homes just recently opened up, but they have been selling these houses, which are townhomes, for quite some time now. But finally, the model homes opened. Now, Toll Brothers is known for opening their, or opening their community before the model homes are done. So we're taking a tour of the Luciana, which is three to four bedrooms, two and a half baths, two car garage, and 2019 square feet. And the base price is $596,995. That's just the base price. Now, depending on the lot premiums and whatever options you select, that price could go up. So these are all three-story homes. And this one, the model has a rooftop deck. Um, not all of them will have rooftop decks. So as you walk in, this one could be what's called a flex space. This one was converted into an office or this would be one big room where you don't have any doors, but this one was converted into a bedroom. That's why it says three to four bedrooms. And then you have a bathroom down here, which is only a half bath, but I would imagine if you make this into your bedroom, then this would be a full bath for the person that stays downstairs. A lot of people like to keep it as the flex space so they can make it into their office or den or whatever. Um, and by the way, I have, my boyfriend Damien with me. Hi. So if you see him, he's out here helping me. He gets to be my coat holder. holder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. So here's the garage with a tankless water heater, two car garage. Normally these model homes lock the garage door so you can't see it. And it looks like they have extra storage space in here for you. So that's really nice. Very nice. So, it looks like they use the engineered hardwood flooring, and this is a very popular color right now. Actually, I love this color. It's the, I think it's a medium tone or a light tone. Love the floors. Now, as you walk in, you have the kitchen. I like this one better. The other one seemed a little choppier. This is more open too. Yeah, this is more open the high ceilings. I love what they did with the kitchen. The quartz countertops, the island, the white flat panel cabinets, and then the double oven, the microwave, perfect positioning where the microwave's located. The cooktop with the range hood. These look like they are, I don't know what brand this is. I don't know, it has a weird label. Never seen that insignia before. Then this one, they selected the large basin sink. But look at this. I like this one a lot. Then, oh my goodness, look at this pantry. Beautiful. Of course, now this is custom. This is not how the pantry is gonna come. It will come more generic shelves, but the size is very nice. I like it a lot. Now the HOA here in this community is a total of $203, $55 is for Summerlin West, $148 is for Cordillera, and this community does have a pool, however, it is not gated. So this one has more private, probably because it's inside, um, has a more private courtyard, which I kind of like this. I like the TV right there. That's really neat. Now, since this community has been building for some time, they probably have a few quick move-ins to choose from. Now, if you were to build from scratch, it would take at least 15 months to build with Toll Brothers. That's why these model homes took forever is because Toll Brothers is known for taking a long time, which is a good thing. There's pros and cons to it, taking a long time to build the home. But I really like this unit that they created. This is like a beautiful, don't you think? Mm -hmm. I love that. I like the high windows too. Yeah, the high windows, the, the back wall feature right here. Mm -hmm. Very nice. But this built-in right here is like, damn. It's very sleek. Very sleek with the black inside and the white. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. 
Now, if you are able to select your options when you buy new construction, it doesn't have to be Toll Brothers. Typically, your flooring is gonna be carpeted throughout the whole house, except for your entryway, your bathrooms, your laundry room, and your kitchen. Um, obviously, if you were to buy from ground up, my money would be spent for sure on flooring to ensure that there is no carpet whatsoever in the entire house. And if I did put carpet, I would put it in the bedrooms only, just for cost effectiveness. Then another thing I would spend my money on is the electrical package. I would make sure that my home, the bedrooms, have all the enough can lighting, pre-wiring for ceiling fans in every room. That's where the money is. And then secondary, obviously, would be your kitchen. Everything else you can do later on in the future, but that's where I would spend my money when I buy a new construction home. So we're gonna go upstairs. Here's the, oh my gosh, love it. See, this is the stack tile size I want. Mm -hmm. Isn't that a good it's size? Perfect. And then so that other house, the bathroom, right here, right the here. kitchen had the stack horizontal tile. That was very nice. So this is beautiful. I love the stack tile. I have the two-tone also. Yeah, the two-tone's nice too. I always like to get design ideas when I come to look at these model homes. <laughs> I am a designer at heart, so I like to decorate. I was constantly doing something in my house. So then just like the other model, if you saw it, all the bedrooms are gonna be on this third floor. So as you walk in, this is just a normal bedroom with a perfect closet. This is actually a very good sized bedroom because you have a queen size bed with two nightstands at the end and also this unit right here and love this window beautiful window look at it pretty soon they're gonna have houses or these townhouses right there and these are the ones that they're pre-building so honestly i don't know if you'll be able to pick your options or if you are you may be able to change your flooring and cabinets um, because they, because of the build time with Toll Brothers, a lot of this is being pre-built right now. Then you have another full bathroom or three quarters bath. I'm sure this could be purchased with a tub shower insert if you like, and the small sink, which is kind of, I think they should have considered something different because a lot of people like having double sinks in the secondary bathroom. Then this must be, huh. So one, two, three, four, I guess a den. This is, could be a, this could be actually a bedroom because this is where the closet would go. So this would be a bedroom. So I don't know why it says three to four bedrooms. Technically this would be Convert into a fourth? Yeah, but then downstairs was supposed to be a flex space. Maybe I was misreading when the Bianca was talking to me. So here's the laundry room. Very small, right off of the primary bedroom and the secondary bedroom, which is kind of interesting. So here is the primary bedroom. I love all these windows, though. Good size. Love the built-ins. Beautiful. Just absolutely gorgeous. Um, king, looks like a king-size bed. Again, with the barn doors, I guess this people, the people that were designing this was really into putting barn doors everywhere. Um, another thing I don't like when the designers do is put the inlay of the carpeting because in the future, if this carpet goes bad, unless you have extra planks, it's going to be hard to change this out unless you want to put carpet again. So that's just a very poor design choice in my opinion. So here's the primary bathroom, beautiful black and white with the same quartz countertops. I think these are quartzite that they have in the bathroom, I mean, in the kitchen downstairs with the white flat panel cabinets, um, like the tile that they put in here as well. And then the, I don't see any tubs in this bottle, full shower and a decent sized closet. Yeah, I definitely like this model, the Luciana, better than the Casella. Um, but again, it's personal preference and personal choice. So this one also has the rooftop deck. These are interesting. Yeah. I don't know if I would want them though. Do you like them? I like them more horizontal than I do vertical. 
Yeah, but do you like the design on it? I think it's nice, nice touch where it's not so simple. Right. But uh, I mean, if you were to do vertical, yeah. Yeah. That, that's kind of cool. Okay, so this one also has views of the other neighbor on this side. So this is a four unit, but for some reason they're not modeling the last house in this community. Um, so the last one actually is, oh, she did tell me that the Renata. So when you have four units, each end is a Renata. So that's why the very first unit we weren't able to see. Whew. Anyway, folks, so this one, you have beautiful views of the Red Rock Canyon. Sorry, it's a bit windy. Then on this side, you have city views. Very nice size. And if these pergolas come with it, that's very nice to have. But it's a bit windy, I'm gonna go inside. It's too cold for me. <laughs> right? Oof, my hair is getting all messy. Okay, folks, let's go back down to the living area, the open floor plan, and summarize what's going on in this model. Woo, this is dangerous. I almost fell down. <laughs> Gotta be careful. <laughs> Hold on to the rails. I don't wanna fall down and break my neck. Then I can't do any more videos. Lots of steps. I have to put the yellow tape so no one hurts themselves. So, so <laughs> to summarize, this is the Luciana, Luciana, and it's 2019 square feet with the option of three to four bedrooms, two and a half baths, two car garage, base priced at 596,995. And I do believe if you had the Grande version, which is the one with the rooftop deck, it's 606,995, I could be wrong. Anyway, folks, let me know in the comments what you think of this floor plan. Let me know if you like this one over the Casella or the next one, which will be the Renata. Make sure you also hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. You can always reach out to me at 702-370-5112. I sell a lot of new construction in Summerlin and I sell a lot of new construction in general. Anyway, folks, peace out. See you guys on the next video.